but old black magic has me in its spell. Well, it has certainly been a long time, but the time has finally come to come back to the original Final Fantasy. If you guys don't know why the series left in the first place, I'll go ahead and link the video explaining why it left. I uploaded a couple days ago, and happy 4th of July, by the way, for those of you that celebrate American stuff. So, as you could no doubt tell, our stats are very different. We've leveled up quite a bit, and we've learned quite a lot of magic spells, such as we now have the best spells with Jackie, we now have Nuke, which is this game's equivalent to Meteo, and with Mel, I believe Fade is this game's equivalent to Holy. I always just knew them as those spells because, like I said, this is my first Final Fantasy game, so I always knew it, oh, that's the Nuke spell. I didn't know what Meteo or Holy were. The main way I did most of the grinding was I was fighting Warmex on this floor, which took a while to encounter, and I didn't always beat with the entire party, and it took using all of my spells. And I, before I fought any of them, I grinded all the way, so Jackie had Nuke before going in, because Nuke took out, like, a good portion of their health, and they'll probably do the same with Tiamat. And you might wonder, why am I doing all this grinding just before Tiamat? We've seen this boss fight, we know how this is gonna go, and this isn't, like, the final boss or anything. But the thing is, is that once we beat this boss, we're immediately gonna be able to head to the last dungeon in the game. There's no more side quests that I'm aware of, anyway. So, I don't think I wanna do this, then grind, and then record the last session. I'm just gonna do everything that's left right now. Anyway, let's go ahead and nuke. This is gonna do quite a bit of damage to him. That's gonna go ahead and do only 103. Alright. 280, there we go. Now, I learned, uh, by looking at a wiki that... Tiamat does not have any particular spell weakness, so that's unfortunate, but I'm pretty sure Nuke and Holy don't have, like, or Nuke and Fae don't have, uh, spell attributes at all. Also equipped some different weapons and armor, but I'm, I haven't kept complete track of, like, exactly what I've done differently. I just know I'm here, I got all the spells I need, and I'm ready to fight Tiamat. 14 damage to Fred, that's nothing. Way to waste your turn, Tiamat, take this 200 damage right there. 14. Ooh, a critical hit from Fred. Very good job, Fred. Now, I'm gonna go out with Pizza, and I'm gonna... I'm gonna go and use the Heal Helmet, since he isn't doing much damage as is. We might as well heal just a little bit for everyone. I'm a little hesitant to use this last Fade, because that means we're gonna be able to use Life 2 here. But I think I'm okay with it, so let's do that. And I'm gonna go ahead and use the next Nuke, because I don't think... XXXX and Zap Exclamation Point aren't even all that good in terms of uh, battle. I just mainly bought them to fill the slots and because I like their names. Hey, Jackie killed him. Okay, three turns, dealt with the Amat. Good XP. Level up for Mel, now level 29. Level up for Jackie, he now has over 300 HP. Good job, man. You finally passed what we had for a long time. And with that, we can exit. And just like that, all the orbs are restored. We've done it. We finally restored all of the orbs to order. There's no more chaos rolling around the world. There's no more earthquakes and tornadoes and, you know, awful stuff that was going on before. I had mentioned in the video about how the series was returning, how this has been one of my favorite Let's Plays to do, and that still holds true even though I did take a break. I love playing this game, and I have so many memories with it. I mean, I've already talked about my memories flying the airship for the first time, uh, listening to the music. There's, there's a great sense of adventure I had throughout the whole thing, and just the concept of the game itself was so cool to me. This game where you had your own party and it was a long, lengthy RPG experience. This game was one of the most charming and fun experiences for me, and unfortunately, it had to come to an end. You see, I got to a situation very similar to my own right now. I got right outside the final dungeon, I knew this is where I was supposed to do it. I used a save device, and in this game, when you save, you have to hold reset when you turn it off. That's exactly what I did, and it tells you to do that every time you go to the inn. So, use my tent right out here, turn the game off, I made sure to hold reset as I did so, turned it on just a bit later just to make sure it had saved, not to do anything, but just to double check. And I had noticed that my save file was gone. I hit continue, but it seemed that the cartridge save system had been fried up. All of that time was wasted. All of my memories with the new characters and the story and the music, all of my time I spent grinding levels and going through dungeons, getting new magic and armor and weapons, it was gone. I was absolutely devastated. 
Since my dad felt so bad for me after the experience, he got me an emulator along with ROMs for the original six Final Fantasy games, and I went back to this game. I didn't even care that I'd lost everything I had gone through, I still play through it again, just because that's how much I love this game, and how much I want to talk to you guys about it. I've played this game so many times, and that has not stopped me from doing this Let's Play, even though it was a massive break, which I won't get into in the Let's Play itself, just because... This is something I want to do, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Here inside the original castle where we rescued Princess Sarah, we need to interact with this dark orb here. The four orbs now cover the black orb. To take a step forward is to go back 2,000 years in time. And just like that, we are sent to the final dungeon of the game where we now must face all four fiends over again, and finally, the big boss himself. We're 2,000 years in the past, with the four orbs in hand, here to rescue the world. So let's go!